dudes and dudettes of YouTube land. It's Frank with What's the Point EDC and I'm back. I told you guys I had a lot coming. I wasn't lying and I'm not disappointing. I said it in the video before this. I'm not disappointing now. Check this out. Savivi Maxwell. It was a gift from my sister. She was watching a Bees Blades live. Seen Bees Blades pull this up. Called me up. Asked me what it was. I told her I was watching the same live. I went ahead Woke up in the morning, got a phone call, bam, look what got brought over. Uh-huh, Savivi Maxwell, holy freaking moly. We're going to go ahead and get straight into this thing right here. <gasps> holy shit, dang. So look, she told me she looked, she already done took the package out and looked at it herself because she wanted to see it so bad, so that's how much she liked it. Holy, she didn't even know this was on the checklist. She had no idea. Let me go ahead and do this real quick. Got a couple stickers in this for you. I got a lot coming, so we're going to be fast with it. We got the sheath, finger thing. I guess this is a tech lock. Oh, and that's sweet. I've never owned one like that. That is sweet. I'm going to dig this hardcore. Okay, we got the little thing in here. A little rag. I'm actually going to keep this on the table. It's so visible. And look at the freaking prize package. Holy cheese, look at this. I'm going to give you guys a quick view. Oh, this is freaking huge. Man, is it, is it a Tonto, a modified Tonto? What is this? I know it's badass. It's full tang. It's got a freaking doodad holder on it. Man, is this thing ever stout? Vicious jimping. G10 scales. D2 blade steel. I have never got to hold this in person. Finally. Ooh, it's been on the list. Uh, look at the light hitting that thing. Cling. Look at that. Bling, bling. <laughs> oh, my Lord. This thing's flapping around. I'm over having a good time. Man, look at the size of the blade. Talk about blade to handle freaking ratio. Look, look at the tip on that thing. Shoo. Dang, guys and gals. Man, let's do a pocket check real quick while I'm thinking about it. So I'm I'm rocking my gift for a while right here. That's that Spyderco Manix 2 lightweight, lightweight in the uh, Spy 27 steel. Let me show it to you real quick. Now right here it goes, Spy 27 steel. Good stuff, guys. I don't know, I'm just now learning this is a proprietary Spyderco steel. I did not know that Crucible made this just for Spyderco. Very interesting. Also, I got my SOG Telus on me. Man, this thing is a certified beast. I cannot wait for the weather to change up so I can go out here and get you guys some excellent hard use videos. And the last thing I'm carrying, and the video is up of this, by the way. And everything else, there's videos up, and there's going to be close-up videos coming. Just you guys kick back. The next few days is going to be off the chain. Look at this right here. The Rovi Vaughn Aurora 2 Gen 3. Magnetic pocket clip. Little doodad holder. A doodad holder. I mean, a, a lanyard will be on this. I'm not going to put a doodad on it. Doom recommended just put a few snake knots on there. Doom recommends it. It's approved. Good to go. All right, guys. Look, I'm having a good time. Oh, yeah. Let me show you this one right here. So. This right here was a recommendation from Grugs at Legion Tactical Cutlery, and I got it yesterday. And if you haven't seen the video, it's out right now. Check it out. It's the Flissa. I used this link. I got it. It's freaking badass. It's D2 steel, just like that Maxwell is. It's a uh, great fixed blade knife, it seems. It was only 20-something bucks. That's what he said. But when I clicked on the link, no, it was $17. Oh, yeah, $17. Check it out real quick. Clip point. Bam greatness and it is really comfortable in hand it's got a fire steel and everything check that video out adjustable good stuff appreciate it man all right guys so i'm give you a little show of this in the case i guess i didn't do that yet huh man that is sweet look at that man that's gonna carry all right i mean that looks pretty big but I definitely carry the Laser Strike SE and the um, and the SE6 too, uh, horizontally. So I'll be able to do it, I guess. I don't know if this thing spins around or not. You can do this thing. 
I don't think you can, so maybe not. I don't know. Either way, I don't give a damn. Look at this. Look, man, I got one last thing to say. I'm going to say this. It never gets old for me. I stand for things. And that's if you're an addict to never quit quitting. Stay strong and live long. Much love to everybody out there on YouTube. Much freaking love.